partnership with the Bethel Town community in Westmoreland, Jamaica. School News Nationwide, Jamaica Relief, has established a project to help develop their community. The SNN Jamaica Relief mission is fivefold. Number one, to build five homes for impoverished families, establishing a fund to aid families with housing construction and repair. Number two, to establish a meal program that would feed more than 652 children daily. Number three, to build a library and endow it with 10,000 books. Number four, to build and equip a computer laboratory for the school and community. Number five, to build a 400 yard play field for more than 700 students. I'm Owen Wigan, the local coordinator for Jamaica Project Relief. My job entails getting together all the paperwork for the recipient of the housing for this project and the people who will be receiving houses were persons whose houses were totally demolished by Hurricane Ivan. We have a total of five houses slated to be rebuilt. Approximately six months ago, this family was displaced, a young mother with three kids, and per presently she's staying with relatives close by to her. Be one of the persons that will be uh, um, eligible for housing in the future. The issue of housing is a very serious and grave one in the Middletown community. Um, for one, so the population in Middletown is growing. I said, the word growing might not be adequate to describe it. It's booming. And um, a lot of people don't have lands on which to build houses. And for those who, so for some of those who have access to land, they don't have access to the money to build houses. With, uh, with, with, with Mr. Tingling mm -hmm. and, and a group of a group of uh, Jamaicans who have been abroad, you know they they have seen our needs and they have decided that they would try and get some support. Education is good. Some of them will come in and and, and emphasize the positive education, but majority is is a by the way thing. If it happens, it happens. Mm. But the bottom line here. They must get something to eat. Yep. And, and so we need to put in place the infrastructure which, which can support them, we can move them forward. Because the school, the, the school room, the classes, the classes are overcrowded. We have too many children sitting in one place, and there's not enough space and all of that. They start the computers from grade three, but by the time they reach to like um, grade six, they would have mastered the computer skills. One well, a, a bit, I I don't know, but but for me personally, I would think that's a greater need that we have. There's a need for a play field, mm. <laughs> and, and we, which we have over there and which is on the plan, but it's a matter of making it into a play field, you know. Presently what I'm trying to do for the Bethelton or the school is to get the pit latrines change, get them changed over to the water closet, have dialogue with Rich the Reef. Yes, I still want to, I want to do something for my school. That's my school, that my children, I have four children that attend that school. Fulfilling their dreams, a documentary on a town and a school seeking higher ground. The 
SNN Jamaica Relief team members are Andy Puello, Michael Tingling, Hugh Dawes, Monica Bisson, Laurie Walwin, David Leader, Gracie Johnson, Ronald Click, Bill Tingling, Monica Bison.